The Nuclear Regulatory Commission hosted a public meeting today to discuss the potential reopening of the Palisades nuclear power plant. News 8's Adriana Dorio went to the meeting and has more on what people had to say. A public meeting held to hear the community's input on whether or not the Palisades power plant should reopen and the meeting also discussing the possible environmental impacts. The meeting bringing out members of the public to learn more about an environmental review being conducted on the Palisades power plant and the potential reopening of that plant. My concern is, though, it's old. They shut it down for a reason. Never once in our history have we reopened a nuclear power plant. It just doesn't happen. Do I want the first to be in my backyard? Not really. The plant closed operations back in May of 2022, and ever since, Holtec International filed several requests for licensing that, if approved, would return the plant back to operational status. This meeting, just one of the steps in that process. We are taking the time to come out to the community to talk about the environmental review this evening. And where we are in that process is right at the very beginning. And environmental impacts of that potential reopening were at the top of mind. Palisades is a clean source of energy. It's 100% carbon free. So when we're talking about climate change and also keeping the lights on, we're a key solution for the state of Michigan. But some folks in the audience disagreed. How am I convinced that it's clean energy? I'm not. I'm not convinced nuclear is clean. We just had a power outage for a tree falling down on the lines the other day. So we were out of power for like 30 hours. So you can have all the power in the world, but if our infrastructure is poor and it can't get to people's homes, it doesn't matter how many power plants you have. This meeting, just the first phase in a long process ahead, leaving many eager on what will come next. We have to do our due diligence on both the environmental and the safety side. So we will do our review. It will take the time that it takes. We understand the urgency in, uh, in the part of Holtec and the state of Michigan in seeing if Palisades can be brought back online. As things move forward, we'll see how the schedule progresses. The NRC spokesperson tells me that they hope to have a draft review of this out early next year and hopefully wrap up this process by the end of next year. In Benton Harbor, Adriana Doria, News 8.